this semester, all our materials are going to be posted on Brightspace. And you'll see there's a couple different types of weekly material. They're required readings and videos. And those are going to be all available for free. It's a zero textbook cost course. And those are going to make up the majority of your weekly work. But the big thing you need to pay attention to every week in your weekly materials is this weekly notes, or as I call them on Brightspace, your weekly summary. Each week on Monday, unless otherwise noted, uh, I will be posting written and filmed notes that are going to help tie the material for the week together. So those you can choose to read or to watch or both. Um, I encourage you to watch it and read and look at the notes along with the video, but you are welcome to do one or the other. And those notes are going to help guide you through the required readings and videos. Now, all of that sort of takes the place of weekly in-person lectures and weekly homework. Now, because of that, those two things are going to really inform a class discussion on the discussion boards, which are sort of our other component. So imagine, if you will, you have these sort of required readings and videos are kind of like your homework. The weekly notes are kind of like the lecture portion of the class. And then the discussion is kind of like the class discussion portion of the class. So it's a good way to think about this course if you're not familiar with asynchronous classes, but you are familiar with in-person or synchronous ones, that may be a good way for you to think about our course materials and our course work. And you'll notice there are also two other types of materials, recommended readings and videos. Those are, you know, what they sound like. They're readings and videos that I recommend but don't require.